Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get as many Android L features on your uh, previous generation Android phones. So as you can see here, I have a Samsung Galaxy S4. This isn't one of the Nexus devices, but I still have a pretty good Android L mock uh, design going on on my phone. So the first thing that we're going to do is talk about the keyboard, and I'll give you a quick demo of what that looks like here. So here's the Android L keyboard. It's got our swipe, everything else. And the way that we're going to get this is by going over to the Android Play Store and searching for Android L keyboard. I'll show you here. It's the first one at the top, Android L keyboard pro. Click on that, hit install and open it up. It'll walk you through the steps of changing your keyboard over to Android L. Next up is the icons. These icons come courtesy of a completely free icon pack called Moonshine. So you can see here I have the app called Moonshine installed and we're going to get that again in the Android Play Store. Search for Moonshine icon pack. That's one of the first ones up here. You can see it says Moonshine Icon Pack. It is by Nextbit Design. If you install that, open it up, and you'll see here it says Apply Theme. When you click that, you need to have a uh, Nova Launcher or Apex, AV, ADW, Action, or Smart. Actually, there's a couple others. Go or Hollow uh, launchers installed. If you have one of these installed, go ahead and click it right there. If not, go and install Nova Launcher is the one I recommend, and then come back and install it that way. Uh, that'll set up all your icons. Next up is the wallpaper. Um, if you click on that, you can see that we have all of the different Android L design uh, wallpapers. So if I scroll over here, we got one for morning, sunset, Android L, Moonland. Just an interesting uh, set of designs. So um, the last thing that I want to talk about is a Nova Launcher update, which will help you get some more features. So I mentioned Nova Launcher a couple of seconds ago. Uh, Nova Launcher basically is a home screen replacement. And if you uh, have their latest version, there's a number of settings that I'm going to walk through. The first here is in Nova Settings and it's getting the L style folder preview. So if we click on, uh, so we did settings, we're gonna go to folders and then folder preview right here and change it to line. So I'll show you what that looks like. Um, basically I have some folders here under financial, you can see how they're in order. So that's how they're just styled on Android L. Uh, next up we're gonna do the app animation. So when I opened Chrome and shut it down, you can see how it sort of slides down, slides up. See that? That's the new Android L style animation. We're gonna get that by going back to Nova Settings. We're gonna click on Look and Feel. We're gonna click on App Animation and change to Slide Up L Developer Preview. Uh, finally, the last thing is the L style app drawer icon. So if we're going to long press on that, click edit, click the button, and then it has built in defaults. The one that's all white right here, that's the L preview style launcher icon. And then you can notice that it's now the solid white down there at the bottom. And uh, well, one other thing I forgot, the uh, search bar, which I do not have installed on my uh, home screen here, but if you do use the persistent search bar that shows up on your home screen, then what you can do is click on the settings and go to desktop and then go to persistent search bar and you now notice an L preview entry in there. If you click on that and you uh, have a search bar on your screen, you'll see that show up as well. So that is the complete guide to getting your Android device looking as close to the L preview as possible um, without actually having the new L developer release installed. So thanks for watching, and if you have any questions about this, leave a comment and I'll do my best to help you out.